It's whatever she said It's whatever she said It got stuck in my Welcome back to my channel. I am back today with another video and today of course we have another wig to review. The wig that we are going to be checking out is going to be this one right here. This one is a new one from Bobby Boss. The name of this wig is called Yulia. This one was sent to me from ebonyline.com so of course y'all know I have to give them a huge shout out for sending me this wig. Thank you very much. It is highly highly appreciated. So y'all let's get into what Yulia is looking like. First of all, let's read all the deets on Yulia. Um, she is, like I said, from Bobby Balls. She has a five inch deep part lace, ear to ear, hand tied, natural baby hairs. She can be heated up to, they don't say how high we can heat this one up, but it does say premium high heat fiber. Safe heating, so y'all, I don't know anything about that. Just. Be careful if you decide to go ahead and put some heat on it. We're going to find out today. Hopefully, I won't burn it. But um, anyway, it says Flex Fit Cap. The color that I have is HL613-627. So, yeah, that's about it. So, let's see what she is looking like. Okay. Loving the color, y'all. Very, very pretty. She's feeling very soft. So, the inside of the wig has... One comb in the back with the two adjustable draw straps and the two combs in the front. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take this one off and put her on. But of course, if you are interested in these contacts, these are from a company called TTDI and mine are prescribed, but you don't have to get prescribed if you want, but they are very, very affordable. And if you wanna save an extra, you know, few coin or two, go ahead and use my coupon code called Phoebe. So I will be right back with Yulia on. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so this is her just thrown on my head. And I think this is gonna be easy to style, y'all. I really do. Let me get up close so y'all can see everything that's going on with this one. Okay, so first off, the parting space looks really, really good. The five inch part is definitely there and I don't think we need to go in and pluck or do anything. So this is the hairline. They said that the hairline would, be, would blend in seamlessly. So we'll see about that. The knots are pretty big on here, so I definitely have to go in with my powder and um, concealer or whatever and try to, you know, get these knots to kind of look a little bit smaller. This one is not ear to ear. My edges are peeping out. So I am going to lay my edges down to make sure it blends in. So, yeah, it does feel big hair friendly, y'all, to me. Usually, a lot of times I can't tell because I could fit almost every wig, but yeah, this one is pretty big hair friendly in my opinion. So yeah, I'm gonna go in and style her up. I'm gonna see if we can shift her to the left side so we can have options. So yes, just continue on watching and we will talk about her at the end of the video. Through my shadow, through the sun rays and on and on we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways and on. Okay, 
y'all, so let's talk about Miss Yulia. I think she is really, really pretty, y'all. But of course, I have pros and I do have some cons with Miss Yulia. So let's get into all the pros first. Obviously, this color is really, really pretty in my opinion, y'all. I really am a fan of this color. This is like one of my favorite blondes and Bobby Boss did an amazing job on the color. We got the dark roots right here and it does go throughout when it comes to the whole wig, even back here in the kitchen area, y'all. So, I mean, awesome job on the color. As for the style, I really do like the style, y'all. Great thing about it, we can shift it. So, I know a lot of people in general don't like that middle part. A lot of people, I'm realizing that lately. So, this one is real nice because we can shift it to the left or the right side. So, I'm definitely here for that. As for the baby hairs, they were pretty good. I mean, they were thin enough for me to go ahead and lay them down, which is definitely a plus, not too thick at all. As for the density on this one, y'all, this one is perfect for me, y'all. I see this in a lot of my videos. I'm not here for the extra, extra thick wigs. I prefer wigs that have more of a natural density, and this one is really, really natural. Some may think this is too thin, but for me, I think it's the perfect density and I really, really like it. One thing about it is that it may be a little bit more thinner at the top and I'm not sure if you can see the track, so that might be a con because I can feel the cap a little bit more at the top right here, but otherwise, I like the density on this. As for the texture, the texture is more on the silky side, so I don't know if my Yankee people gonna like this one, but I don't think it's extra, extra silky. And I know a lot of people don't like it because it looks like baby doll hair, but I don't think this one look like baby doll hair at all. She is silky though. And she is a little shiny. I don't think she's too shiny, but of course, if you think that she's too shiny, go ahead and spray that dry shampoo or baby powder on it just to dull it down. But I don't think she's too shiny and I won't be adding anything to this wig. As yes. for my cons, the cons that I do have is that she does tangle. My hands did get stuck quite often in this wig. I did get some shedding. I don't think it's like an overwhelming amount of shedding, but you are gonna get some shedding out of this one. And I think it's probably because of the color. The colored wigs definitely tend to shed more and tangle a bit more than the yakky textures. So um, yeah, that's my... Um, cons for this wig okay y'all so let's talk about the price another good thing about this wig is that it is super super affordable you can find this one on ebonyline.com for only $25.95 and no upcharge for most of the colors but for some reason y'all this one right here is five dollars more for this color I'm not sure why I know the color is very very pretty but yeah y'all know how I feel about that upcharge not my cup of tea i'm pretty sure most of you would agree but yes it's five dollars more for this one which makes this only thirty dollars and 95 cents so of course if you want the color you know we gotta just go ahead and pay for it so anyway y'all i'm gonna go ahead and end this video please like subscribe and comment and let me know what y'all think about this unit y'all already know my thoughts i want to know yours so i will see y'all in my next video